so I know that this is not the best of background but I'm just vlogging um but I wanted to film a video today where I just do a day in the life of me so from start to the end of the day and basically I this today is an important day because today is the day that I'm supposed to hand in my dissertation so what well, I say supposed I am handing in my dissertation today um, so yeah, I've still got like a lot of that. Well, not a lot. I've still got a bit of that to do. So I'm going to do that this morning and just have like little intervals. What I have found when it's come to my dissertation is that doing like half an hour intervals where I actually time myself on my phone half an hour and then I have a like a break and then I come back and do another half an hour. That works so well. If I didn't time myself, then I would get distracted. Whereas if you see the timer going, you're like, no, um, I can't get distracted because I've got that half an hour um so yeah I found that worked for me so that's what I tend to do I got up made myself a coffee which is in this mug obviously and um and washed my face that's why I've got this headband on <laughs> yeah great and I've got my um Lincoln Uni hoodie on um as well so it's just a casual day this video is actually going to be in collaboration with an eyewear kind of like um glasses sunglasses brand they do a various different things they've actually sent me two of their glasses i'm going to talk about them a little bit later on in the video but i just wanted to let you know that it's this video or that section of the video is in collaboration with them and actually i'm excited to share with you the glasses that i've got because especially one of them has helped me so much whilst i've been writing my dissertation so we'll come to that later on so i have a few things that i need to do today for example i've got to put my bins out which means to like empty all my bins oh damn it i don't have any bin liners I've got one bin liner never mind i'm doing a food shop on friday and today's tuesday so yeah oops didn't think that through um anyway i'm also gonna clear my phone and my laptop which means to just get rid of stuff on there because i hate it when i've got like a billion photos on my phone so i'll just get rid of them usually they're just pictures for my skincare business anyway that i've already posted so i'll just go through and get rid of those um and then i've got a little workout i'm gonna do today i'm gonna do a little bum and arm workout today and um that's pretty much the day obviously handing in my dissertation as well but yeah don't worry that doesn't sound like a lot of stuff but i always manage to fill the day do i have some floor i swear i've written on my weekly planner by the way does anyone like my weekly planner i decorated it with like things um i didn't buy any of these stickers these came with a few things um and these are things that i've got with orders and stuff that i find really cute um and yeah so decorated it like that but yeah i swear i had the flora to do today oh no the floor is tomorrow right i'm gonna drink my tea uh, my coffee and i'll see you later on hello i'm wearing my glasses that i'm going to be speaking about later on um these are blue light thingy glasses that's why i'm wearing them um whilst i do my dissertation but i thought i would just take a little break i had my breakfast i had porridge and like peanut butter mixed in it with some banana and like honey and just random stuff in there um which i had and now i'm gonna crack on with the rest of it my dissertation is due in one hour and 20 minutes i've basically written the entire thing i'm just kind of going through adding a few words there's just a few more words that i need to do so i'm just kind of go going through it and what you know when you read like i don't know what to add to it but when you start reading through it suddenly you think oh yeah i'll add that oh yeah i'll add that and there's ten thousand words worth of information for me to read now so i'm sure i can add enough words you know to literally get to um ten thousand because i think i'm like 200 away um so i'm gonna do that and then i'm just gonna like go through and like make sure that the layout's okay and that it looks looks all right and you know i'm not expecting to get an amazing grade on this at all I've tried my best I know it's not the best but again like everything that I do I try my best with the situation that I have and you know I don't have hell loads of time just to focus on this because I have my revision for my normal exams as well and I have obviously everything else to consider that I do in my day-to-day -day life which is not that much but it still takes up loads of time um I'm the kind of person that I can't just focus on uni and not do the other things that I like to do for example making youtube videos some people would you know take a few weeks off doing that i just can't do that because i would not feel happy i would feel like incomplete and i don't like that i want to you know do what i normally do and then i've got this on top so all my cleaning tasks i still do daily um all of my um fresh face stuff that i do packaging orders and stuff like that just 
I'm still doing it all because it makes me feel happy. So yeah, um, anyway, I need to crack on. I will see you when I've handed it in. Goodbye. I have just finished my dissertation. It's 12 o'clock and I have just finished doing it. Don't know how well I've done. I will let you know when I get my results in the future. But yeah, I've been sat on the sofa finishing it off because my laptop ran out of charge so the lead wouldn't have reached my desk, which is in front of me. But yeah, handed it in, see how I did. I handed it in and I literally was checking through the whole thing. And when I usually have like a normal assignment, the checking time for that is not quite as long as a dissertation. So I um, went through like checking through each section of the dissertation and the only thing that I didn't manage to check is kind of like the conclusion, which I probably should have checked mainly, but you know, we'll see what happens um and then i just wrote a little bit extra at the bottom so we'll see what happens um but yeah i did notice though after i submitted it finally by the way it's just over ten thousand words if you're wondering um yeah after i submitted it there is because i have a few images that's in my dissertation um because it shows what i did for my primary research and um I had put an image on there twice for some reason and accidentally overlapped it. So basically there was an image of itself, like on itself, but it looked a bit off. So that's the only thing that's wrong, but that shouldn't be too much of a problem because um, they can see the actual image. So that's okay. But yeah, um, so that's a relief that that's finished now. I'm going to be cracking on with revision now for my actual exams. Not right now don't worry <laughs> but um yeah like later on and tomorrow and whatever um but yeah i'm now gonna chill for a bit and then i'm gonna crack on with the rest of the day i was gonna put my makeup on and i was gonna sit down and i was gonna talk to you about the collaboration you know with these glasses but i cannot be bothered to do my makeup after that so i will talk to you about the glasses when i've just chilled a little bit but yeah that's in it's done goodbye also the other day my dad put in a new carpet in the kitchen i don't know if anyone can remember what it used to look like but basically it used to look like this with tiles there is a little bit missing but that's fine this was basically the carpet in my parents bedroom for like 30 years so that's why there's quite a lot of like fading but this is just so much warmer for me to like walk on and stuff so yeah I like having a carpet in here it's so much better and much cozier um so i just thought i'd let you know that I'm about to make some lunch and excuse <laughs> there's a random pepper what is that <laughs> right okay um maybe I put that there for Stanley or something I don't know but yeah um oh, and there's a pepper seed what is going on with peppers um right yep and there's half a banana this is a random fridge this is very random half a banana beans homemade jam curry leftover um shortbread dairy dunkers curry paste and then this is what i'm having today um i think there's anyone left yeah one of these um vegan sausages these are actually really nice i got this from lidl and yeah they're not like corn substitutes sorry that's just making me laugh um they're not corn substitutes they're like vegetably so um yeah but they are really good and you get six in a pack and it was like one pound something so i would recommend I think I'm going to do some baking later. I want to make some lemon cupcakes, I think. Also, if anyone's wondering, this is the Zaflora that I have for spring. Um, this is the Bluebell Woods one. I had the grapefruit one before, and then this is like my spring scented one. And there's not actually that much left in here. Well, there is, but I use it quite a lot. Um, I use it for any kind of cleaning that I do. And then twice a week, I also um, put it in a bowl with boiling water. And then I clean the surfaces of my entire flat. But yeah, this is a good one. I would recommend if you haven't had it. in the oven that I could sit down and talk to you about 
the fact that this video is in collaboration with an eyeglasses brand like glasses when i say glasses i'm thinking of like drinking glasses eyeglasses sunglasses wearing glasses whatever um but it's in collaboration with this brand that i will leave on the screen i'm very bad at pronouncing names um i have it right in front of me and i don't think i can pronounce it which isn't my fault completely um but yeah they kindly sent me a couple of their glasses and i was so surprised at how much i've been wearing especially one of these glasses now they sent me two the the first one was blue light filter glasses and both of my glasses by the way are non-prescription because i don't have prescription um glasses anyway and this is what it comes looking like so when you first receive it obviously it's all packaged up um but this is the box that it comes in i have two glasses in this box but i think if you ordered one obviously you just have one glasses in there um and oh they've got an instagram as well i will leave their instagram in the description as well if you're interested um but yeah that's the box and then the first kind of pair of glasses that i'm going to talk to you about are the ones that i've been wearing the most recently which is the blue light filter glasses so this is what they look like i did select these off of their website um it's hard to show you um i've got a plain white piece of paper that might be handy yeah like that um, so this is what they look like and basically I was actually very intrigued as to what it would be like to wear these because I've never actually used like blue light filter glasses before and yeah they work because as soon as I popped them on everything in the room went like a greeny kind of colour like not green but just like a warm toned colour rather than cool toned and I wore these whilst I was doing my dissertation like a few days ago when I was doing quite a lot of it in one go and I could just whack out my dissertation like so quickly and nothing was straining my eyes or anything like that and as soon as I took them off suddenly the screen was just annoying like it was bright and just irritating and i felt like that if i had not been wearing these glasses my eyes would be really hurting from like looking at a screen for so long doing my dissertation so honestly i've been wearing these so much i literally been wearing these like every single time i've been on my laptop i don't watch wear them whilst i'm watching youtube videos or anything like that but i do wear these when i have like a white bright screen in front of me um which is quite often very happy with these very impressed with these and i will be wearing these a lot it came with this case here um which obviously i have actually been keeping the glasses in just to keep them safe and everything like that because i don't want to scratch them because i really really like them and i'm wearing them so that's what the case looks like and you just pop them straight in here so very obsessed with those love those and they 100 percent work and i would definitely recommend I will leave a link to their website in the description and I will also link both of the glasses that I have chosen and that I'm showing in this video. The second pair comes in this um, case, which I actually prefer this case in terms of colour to this one because I kind of like the colour grey. This is some sunglasses. So again, non-prescription. I picked these also and this is what they look like. So I'll do that thing again where I show it here. But yeah, they're like blue um like the outer parts are blue what is it called like they're the lenses and then that's the non-lenses i don't know what i'm saying um but yeah i love these so these are the sunglasses wow okay everything oh my god i can see so much better there's people walking out i can actually see better whoa i think i can see better because it's kind of bright outside like it's not necessarily sunny but it's bright and this just tones it down oh yeah because when i'm looking inside it's very dark and um, it's because i'm facing a window but yeah these are the sunglasses that i picked and yeah i needed a new pair of sunglasses the current ones i've got are actually from primark and they were literally a pound and the lens keeps coming out and yeah i don't i didn't tend to use them for sunglasses i tended to use them um as a headband um but yeah these ones look great so yeah i haven't had chance to use them that much i think i've worn them a couple of times because it hasn't been that sunny um in england for the past week or so since i've had them so yeah i will have to give them like a true test and yeah i will update you on both of these glasses in the future but i just wanted to say that this section of the video is in collaboration with this company i'll leave on the screen um and yeah very happy with both of them the quality of them is really really nice and sturdy and i can just tell that i'm not going to break these easily i don't tend to break glasses anyway i think my primark ones broke because they were a pound but yeah so love these i actually really like those um but yeah i'm gonna pop those away and then the last thing just to tell you about this is that 
it comes with one of these little guys which is used to clean the glasses now i'm not an eye like a glasses wearer i've never needed to wear glasses really and i did not know how annoying it is when you accidentally smear the lens and all you can see is like a smear so i've been using this a lot just to kind of make my vision better but yeah um thank you for them for collaborating me with this section of the video and super happy with everything all links will be in the description and the links to their website links to the products themselves and their instagram will all be in the description if you are interested in checking them out because they're high quality and they work and honestly if you are on your laptop a lot or you're in a rock and or you're in an office and you're working on your computer a lot try blue light filtering glasses because my brain would have strained so much if i hadn't have used those so yeah um end of section so this is my lunch i've got a wrap pepper cheese that but um sausage thing vegan sausage and a little bit of barbecue sauce and i am gonna eat it as a wrap don't worry but it's just quite a lot of stuff in it that it just doesn't close up properly um and then i'm also gonna have this little mini shortbread gingerbread man no ginger in it um but you know what i mean and i'm gonna have that don't worry the table's clean i cleaned it so yeah there he is oh i made him the other day i nearly stabbed his leg <laughs> I thought I'd show you a couple of things that I picked up from The Ordinary. This was like a couple of weeks ago. I got hyaluronic acid from them, um, which, oh my God, can I open this with one hand and nails? Yes, we can. <laughs> it can be done. Um, but yeah, basically I haven't used this yet because, basically I haven't used this yet because I'm using up a hyaluronic acid that I've currently got, which is this one from Skin Diva, um, but it's very close to the end. So I wanted another one because hyaluronic acid is just so good for like soft skin. Then I got the Ordinary Peeling Solution. You might have seen this quite a lot online because a lot of people have been speaking about this, but I've used this in the past and I just wanted something to exfoliate my skin that wasn't like a facial scrub. So yeah, I picked this up and I've used this quite a few times. I'll update you in like a future video as to how I get along with this. Also on my bed, I have this, which is something that I picked up when I was in New Zealand, you know, just casually as you do. Um, when I was like 12 years old, I went to New Zealand with my uncle and my cousin and I picked up this little kiwi whilst I was there. I kept the label on it and what was it? $9.90 worth every single penny. Um, so yeah, he sits on here. Whilst I was in New Zealand, I did actually see some like real life kiwis, like the little guys with their little legs and yeah, they're so cute. They're, I think they're going extinct or they're not very common anyway, but I have this tattoo on my wrist that's a hippo and on the other wrist, I want to get a tattoo of um, like an outline of a kiwi bird. That's like my next thing that I want to do because it's cute. I also got this, all of this stuff from New Zealand. Um, not this. <laughs> um, but yeah, this, as you can tell, is from New Zealand because it says New Zealand on it. And if you didn't know, sheep outnumber people in New Zealand by like, it's either five to one or eight to one or something. But yeah, so there's a lot of sheep in New Zealand. And then I also got this, um, which again says New Zealand on it. And it's just got a little kiwi inside. And then I don't know what this is, but I also got this and I kind of like it. So yeah. They just chill here. A little tour of my New Zealand things randomly. Whilst I'm showing you like randomly bits and bobs, I wanted to show you a few jewelry pieces that I got from this Depop seller who was really very nice. And I did put up an Instagram post about this and about her jewelry um, the other day now. And I wanted to show you what like it comes in and do a little unboxing in here so yeah um yeah i bought a few things i love like how everything looks it's like cool jewelry like it's not your typical kind of pieces and they just look so nice so i wanted to just feature it um in this video but i will show you the things that i got but she was so cute she added a little mawam into the order she also added which i ate straight away <laughs> and i kept the wrapper just for this she also added in little stickers, which you can see I've stuck them on here. It's these like bigger stickers. So like this one, this one, this one, and this one. Um, so yeah, um, I thought that was a cute idea. And then she also added in a free little um, like hair tie. It's kind of like the one I've got in now, but it, it's upstairs because I like alternate between my hair ties. And yeah, that was, I've been wearing that one a lot. It's like leopard print. I will show you, maybe I'll show you later on, but yeah, I really like that. 
So this is the things that I picked up. The first one was this one. This is like a little purple kind of like a lollipop themed necklace. I really love this one. I put it back on the thing just to show you, even though I didn't do that with the other two. Um, I was gonna, but I couldn't be bothered. Um, here is the other one. This one's like a lollipop but it's like a different color if you know what I mean. I really love those, that's why I wanted two. And then I also got this, so this is prawn cocktail, like Walker's prawn cocktail crisps on a necklace. That's my favorite flavor of crisp and I just thought that was such a cool idea. So yeah, those are the pieces that I picked up but I just love the extra things she put in. So I will link her Depop account in the description. I've got so much stuff to link in the description. It is not funny. In fact, I won't link her Depop account, I will link her Instagram where you can check out pictures of the items and her Depop is linked in her Instagram. So yeah, I will link her Instagram and then you can go on her Depop via that. This is the hair tie if you was wondering, by the way. Okay, I'm just gonna sit and chill now, put my headband on to get my hair out the way. But basically, I don't know why, I was just feeling so tired and I still am. I think my dissertation this morning has just drained me, but yeah, couldn't even be bothered to do my makeup, you know? Um, and I think what I'm gonna do is just probably just lay down and watch Big Bang Theory on my laptop. So I don't even like, I can't even be bothered to vlog because there's nothing to vlog. I was gonna bake some cupcakes. Can't be bothered to do that. I was gonna do a workout. Can't be bothered to do that. So um, yeah, I do make up for it though. When I've missed a workout, I'll make up for it another day. But yeah, I just think I need to chill and I'll get back on track tomorrow. But yeah, it's a bit of a random like day in the life of me, but I'll try and make the next one a little bit like more throughout the whole day because it isn't really, it's like five o'clock right now um, and I wanted to film from like early morning up till like late at night but yeah, I filmed quite a lot today anyway of just me chatting away so enjoy. But yeah, thank you for watching and I'm just gonna end it here. Um, you'll see a new video next Wednesday and Friday at 9am hopefully. Get a little bit bad with posting but yeah. See you then, goodbye.